So, Mitre Far is a prospective randomized study, a uh, French study uh, supported by uh, the French Ministry of Health. Mm -hmm. So, it's uh, really an academic study. And uh, we tried to test the uh, efficacy and safety of the percutaneous treatment of uh, mitral valve regurgitation in the context of heart failure patients with poor left ventricle. So it's a very uh, restrictive indication. And uh, so far, we had absolutely no evidence-based medicine to support if, uh, the, if we had to treat those mitral regurgitation. And uh, last year, we had two prospective randomized studies, mitral FR and CAT leading to different results uh, because in mitral FR, after one year, the result I presented last year in Munich during the last edition of the ESC, we had no difference between the control group and the group treated with a mitral clip. This was the result one year ago after one year of follow-up for the mitral FR study. Well, uh, you know, COAPT uh, was a result, a uh, study with a, a positive result, very uh, positive result on their primary, primary endpoint, but also on death and all subgroups. So the discrepancy between the two results, the two studies, uh, was uh, the, uh, created a huge debate in our community, leading to more than 200 a citation last year, and no less than 17 editorials published during the last few months. So uh, is, we had a very important debate about this, uh, this topic. And uh, uh, we, the co-op followed the patient up to two years, and it was interesting to see if after one more year of follow-up, the result in MITWIFR was the same. And uh, what we saw is that uh, we have the confirmation that after two years, our primary endpoint, but also our secondary endpoint, are still neutral. No difference between the two groups. But we had some interesting information. Uh, during the second year of follow-up, in the MITRIFAR study, we had less rehospitalization for heart failure in the group uh, treated with the mitraclip. So it is a signal, it is, uh, we, it's fragile. We, we have to, to pay attention because this is a post-hoc analysis. It was not a pre-specified endpoint in uh, our protocol. But this corresponds to the primary endpoint of MITRIFAR, which is the cumulative rate of hospitalization. And this um, uh, was positive if we isolate the second year of follow-up of MITRIFAR. So it's a signal. Interesting, fragile, but interesting in favor of the mitral clip. Oh, yes, we are closer. We have no the exact definition, but we can say that there is probably a group of patients with severe MR, with a ventricle which is not too much deteriorated, patients who are well followed with medical treatment, and who are still symptomatic. Those patients really deserve to get a clip. And by uh, uh, being their valve, uh, middle valve regurgitation corrected, their uh, prognosis is probably really improved. So there is a group of patients who really benefit from the indication for, for, the, for the, the, the mitral clip. There is probably also, on the other hand, a group of patients who are mitral far like, who are too severe the very dilated ventricle and um, regurgitation, which is not very severe if they are really correctly treated with the medication. And those patients are probably too sick. And those patients, if they are not too old, they would better uh, get uh, either a transplantation, heart transplantation, or a cardiac assistance. And in between, there is this gray zone. And this is why we have still work to do. And the good news, is that uh, rather than opposing the two studies, which should be probably the stupid thing to do, the two teams, uh, the, the team of MITRIFAR and the team of uh, uh, COAPT, will join their efforts and we will do a meta analysis using individual data of the two studies. And we will, so far, we, 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 we will have the possibility to get 
close to 1,000 patients and to look at the eco data at, the, at baseline and then to try to define with this large spectrum of population because the two populations are probably different co-op and midwife far. So if we join our effort, we will have a large spectrum which will mimic more or less the, 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 this disease. Right? And we will probably be able to better define who will be the best, best indication inside this gray zone. So we have never been so close to better define the indication of the treatment of uh, the mitral regurgitation in this severe population.